Antoinette, a large crowd of students walked out this morning, and as you look behind me there on the front steps of Brookline High School, you can see there are still some students there right now. They're protesting a video in which at least one student was seen and heard using racial epithets targeting a student of color. Just after 9 a.m., hundreds of Brookline High School students walk out of class. It's a protest over a deeply offensive video with racist language featuring three young men targeting a member of the school's African American Scholars Program. I didn't know there was a lot of support behind us, um, but now seeing how many students are out here, basically the whole school is out to support. It really encourages us to keep fighting for what we believe in. This is not just like a protest for us. This is like for a person of color. This is our life we're fighting for right now. The walkout is a protest not just of the video, but also a protest over how the administration handled the matter. I'm just really disappointed in our administration. I feel like there's a lot more they could have done. I think it's hard when you can't share what the specific discipline was. It always feels frustrating um, to not know exactly what the consequences. It's a fair feeling. Superintendent Andrew Bott says the school has taken corrective action. But after listening to the rally and speaking to students one on one, he acknowledges more needs to be done. We collectively are standing up and saying, we hear you. We are not OK with this. We are not OK with this in our school, in our community. I just hope that this is really an eye opener for everybody. In addition to the discipline administered by the school, Brookline police are also now conducting their own investigation. Reporting live in Brookline, Todd Kiskevich, WCVB News Center 5.